together. So I'm Ismar Volich and I'm the I'm a math faculty at, at Wellesley College and I'm also the director of this Institute for Mathematics and Democracy. So just a few words about this institute. We started it about a year and a half ago. It was of course several years in the in the making and we are housed at Wellesley College and partially found, funded by, by Wellesley College. Uh, and really the, the, we're dedicated essentially in the broad sense to, to research, education, and outreach uh, that lives at the intersection of, of math and math and politics. So, you know, we're concerned with topics like that, that you are all familiar with, sort of the math of electoral college and voting methods and apportionment and gerrymandering, power assessment, social choice theory, game theory, and, and all that good stuff, but also a broader context like you know, political quantitative literacy in education, or the role of data science in politics, and 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 all those all those things that 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 are being more and more talked about. So some of our activities have been so we're we're we have a strong student focus. We have sponsored about a dozen students so far in in research. Uh, research that ranges for sort of hardcore math research and things like, you know, representation theory and, 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 and voting and category theory and, and social choice or probability and gerrymandering, stuff like that. And, uh, but, but also, again, things like, you know, political quantitative literacy in K through 12 education and, and the evolution of, uh, of sort of uh, math and the political discourse over time. So, so stuff like that as well. And we'd like to see even more students involved in, in, in the research that we sort of guide and, and sponsor and supervise. Um, so we have lots of potential topics for people to get involved. If you're a faculty who, who, who are looking to, for, for options for your students uh, to do research uh, with, just let us know and talk to us and, and we'll, we, we can help you figure that out. A lot of our speakers today. The idea was that 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 they would tell us about these things also. Some of these things they have done uh, with their students at their institutions. Uh, we have about so that's that's the students. We also have uh, about thirty um, aff affiliated faculty and and educators and and activists who are we call them affiliates and scholars of the Institute. That really just means that they are people who are doing work or would like to be doing work again in the intersection of math and politics. And, and they are, you know, they're basically on our mailing list. They are, they are, you know, they're the beginnings of this network that we're trying to build for people who care about these, uh, about these things. All of our speakers today are affiliates and st students of, of, of IMD, which was really important to us to, to feature sort of all of you today. Uh, if you'd like to be an affiliate, uh, just contact us and, and, and we'll, we'll, we'll take it, we'll take it from, from there. We also have uh, various sort of educational efforts. We are in the process of curating a, a compilation of resources on teaching math and politics. Uh, I'm here. I have a website. I I am the website in the chat. Did that go? Yes. I can even give you the direct link to these to these teaching resources. Here it is. Uh, so basically, all of the the materials on the resources page were again contributed by by our affiliates who've either taught uh, math and politics class or done summer the summer work or winter workshops or something like that on, on the on the topics so these are all freely available materials we'd like to actually one of the things we're trying to do is is assemble them and streamline them into a web page that is basically going to be kind of a a, a a resource for anyone who would like to either teach a math and politics class or, or take certain pieces of content and plug them into their existing classes. So this website is, if when we make it, it's sort of going to be a roadmap uh, delineated by interests, backgrounds, the level of, of instruction that you want to employ, etc. So we're hoping for that to really become uh, a resource for anyone who's interested in teaching these, these things. We are also developing teaching modules for middle schools and high schools. It turns out a lot of the math and politics teaching can be that, done at, at, at that level. We're happy to have uh, several middle school teachers actually as our affiliates 
and one of them will is one of the one of them is one of the presenters today uh so we're working on the uh, we'd, we'd love to expand this cohort of 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 teachers if you are one or you or you know them and you think they might benefit from being involved with us or or putting them in contact with us please please do so we'd love to we'd like to ex uh, expand that uh there are lots of activities and projects that we have we have planned we are running a summer research program for undergraduate and undergraduates this summer we are partnering with uh, a program called girls get math uh at at iserm in, in providence it's a pro summer program for uh, high school girls so they will be uh using some of our some of our modules uh for that uh, we have lots of lectures and and workshops coming in the fall we have a year-long fellows program for juniors uh, undergrad juniors uh, the idea is that a part of the year they are learning about math and politics and then another part of the year they're actually doing research so that'll be happening in the fall again so lots of stuff we're always looking for ideas if you have some let us know we're always looking for people to get involved uh, if you'd like to get involved, also let us know. Uh, I'd like to th thank some entities and people. So Wellesley College, first of all, for sort of supporting this this event and, and many other things that we do. Uh, my own math department and my own math department chair and the co-founder of IMD, Stanley Ching. And then my colleague, Andy Schultz, who took over a lot of the organizational aspects of this event, and I'm eternally grateful for that. Uh, I'd like to thank the Albright Institute for Global Affairs. They are co-sponsoring this event. Uh, that's another institute at, at Wellesley College. And then I'd like to thank our interns, Lisa Ori and Cece Henderson and Brooke Loomer, especially Lisa and Cece, who've been with this with us for a long time and and have done all the logistics behind this event so they're just incredible amazing uh, help to us so uh the schedule for today is there's these two blocks of, sh of short talks with a break in between uh the first block will be moderated by andy schultz and second by stanley Chang. so this is the 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 last that that you'll hear me blab uh and so there's this break in the middle uh, there's a slight change change in the last talk uh, as of a few days ago. Maybe I'll put up the the conference. Uh, sorry, conference webpage just in the chat in case. If you looked at the schedule over the last few days, that's that's it. It didn't change, but just I think three or four days ago we had a change. Just just the last talk, the speaker was replaced by her 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 faculty advisor actually. So that's the only change. So. Again, thank you all for coming and and being here. I'm gonna turn it over to to Andy, who's gonna who's gonna tell you about a few more logistical things and get us started. Thanks. Perfect. So we're gonna start with talks here. 